Welcome back everyone. In this video, I'm gonna be opening up the Flip Packs Countdown to Christmas Edition. Now, I already opened up the Flip Packs once. I'm gonna link it right up here and it was an awesome experience. I really enjoyed it. Uh, let's just go over what you can get. So these are $40 Canadian each and they are only available in Canada. And this being the Countdown to Christmas edition, the format is a little different. So instead of getting just an assortment of packs, you actually get something for every day leading up to Christmas starting December 19th. There's the very nice uh, flip packs right here. I'll put it in the back. And uh, yeah, basically for every single day, you get one of the options. So for example, on December 19th, you get either an 0809 MVP retail or an 1819 MVP retail. And uh, you can just see that it goes down. It gets much better as we uh, as we go on. And on Christmas Day, there is the chance at either a, a very hard to find nowadays 1314 Panini Prism Retail Pack, 1112 Rookie Anthology Hobby Pack, 0708 Series 2 Retail, 2016 Team Canada Juniors Hobby, or one autograph memorabilia or solid Young Guns card. It says at the top here, there's a Kirill Kaprizov Young Guns Chaser in here. Wouldn't that be insane to just get a crazy Young Guns in here? And uh, yeah, last time I opened this up, it was just phenomenal value for uh, for what you were paying. And I'll definitely be sure to let you know what I think of this one. Here is how you can get in contact with Flippin' Cards to buy one yourself. Remember, it's $40 Canadian each, and they only ship to Canada. So without further ado... Let's jump right in. And so one thing that's cool about uh, this format is you can either choose to open up uh, all the packs at once, or you can just open one up every single day leading up to Christmas. And here we go. Okay, so uh, they're very nicely wrapped. Actually, I'm going to throw the cardboard aside. And we can keep the, uh, the flip packs right here. Okay, so we've got... Uh, oh, very cool. Merry Christmas, Christmas Eve. All right, let's grab the December 22nd. And uh, just take a look at these right here. So we have a December 22nd and December 20th. Okay, cool. So uh, that's actually really nice is uh, you took the time to, uh, to individually wrap every single day. So it's almost like, you know, getting Christmas gifts every single day leading up to Christmas, uh, December 19th. That's actually really cool. I really, uh, I really like this, uh, this idea. That is super original. And uh, yeah, so basically when you go to purchase one, uh, it gets you to pick a random number between one and I can't remember how many there were, but basically I picked number one and uh, yeah, we're gonna have to see what uh, what number one has in store for me. So uh, Merry Christmas and then December 23rd right here. And I do see right through this one, that's a Panini Elite Hobby Pack, which is pretty sick. Last time you were getting at least your money's worth in uh, the packs themselves. So uh, let's see what we get this time. So let's start off with December 19th. All right, so uh, open this up. I believe this was either the uh, MVP 0809 or 1819. So let's take a look at this right here. Oh, nice. I was actually hoping for uh, 0809. That is very nice. Uh, MVP used to be a really good product. You see uh, jerseys are 1 in 48, so they're actually possible in here. I'm just going to do one of these at a time. So instead of unwrapping them all, it's going to be uh, pretty cool to just go through them like this. So let's start off with the uh, MVP 0809, and uh, here we go. We've got uh, Radim Verbata, uh, Steve Ott, Dustin Brown, Jerome McGinla, Mike Green, a decoy, and then a Alexander the Great, and oh, Pavel Datsuk, Winter Classic, very cool, and a Patrick Sharp, Winter Classic. That's interesting. I haven't actually ever opened up uh, 0809 MVP Retail. Only opened up some of the uh, hobby packs, so that's very interesting to get uh, Winter Classic cards. So there you go. That would be for uh, for December 19th. Let's do December 20th now. Uh, see what we can get in here. This is really cool. I like uh, <laughs> I like the individual packs for uh, for every single day. And uh, ooh, I like that. Okay, this is 0607. Heroes and Prospects Hobby. Wow, that is pretty cool. Because you are getting seven days worth of openings, so it's pretty cool to get a hobby pack early on. Uh, Heroes and Prospects, you can usually get uh, autos and jerseys fairly easily in here. So let's see, we've got uh, Marc-Antoine Pouliot, and then cards are upside down. We have uh, Nigel Dawes, former Habs prospect, and then once again, upside down. We have Ladislav Schmid. And is there a sticky card there? Yeah, there is. 
Definitely another card there. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> uh, we've got Dan Fritch, Syracuse Crunch. And then this is one of the uh, He Shoots, He Scores, Decoys, and uh, Kyle Wellwood. There you go. So uh, all base in that pack. My uh, random pack luck is not that good, uh, but that is just always the way it is. So uh, let's jump into uh, December 21st, and uh, let's take a look at what we get in here. So uh, yeah, the packs should be getting uh, better as we move along the days. And uh, here we have an Upper Deck Extended Series pack. Very nice. Is that, uh, yeah, that's, that's the retail pack, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's open this up. Hope for maybe one of the uh, tribute young guns. Alexis Lafrenia would just be crazy. Um, but yeah, it is a possibility. So let's see. Uh, we've got very nice Josh Anderson there. Andrew Shaw, former Hab and current Hab. And then Cam Talbot, Chris Kreider. And ooh, that's actually really nice. Miko Rantanen Dazzlers. It's an orange Dazzlers, maybe gold. I haven't actually ever seen this uh, this color of Dazzlers. So maybe... Maybe this is for the extended retail. Uh, that's pretty nice. And then a couple more base cards. There you go. So no uh, no young guns, unfortunately. But let's move on to December 22nd. Nice uh, green wrapping here. I love the uh, the Christmas colors here for, uh, for every single day. And ooh, now that's, that's actually pretty cool as well. 1718 Series 2 Retail. And uh, yeah, this is a product I haven't opened up much of. And uh, let's just do it. That's awesome. Yeah, I really like the uh, the variety here. And uh, it's just really cool that you even have the chance at getting a uh, Kirill Kaprizov Young Guns on uh, on Christmas Day. That's pretty awesome. Uh, Brendan Smith, Drouin, Brock Nelson, Artem Anisimov, uh, Bernier, Connolly, Cogliano, and Miller. All base. I didn't know you could get uh, all base in Series 2. That's a cool shot of Bernier, though. Uh, but yeah, all base, unfortunately. Uh, let's jump into the December 23rd, which is quite obviously a pack of uh, Panini Elite 11-12. Um, it's actually a pretty thin pack as well, but let's see if we can uh, hit anything in here. Very shiny product. Uh, yeah, lots of uh, foil here. Uh, we've got a blue card coming. So we've got Brian Gianta, and then uh, Joel Ward, and a rookie, the Winnipeg Jets. And I can't read this name. This is uh, Paul Postma. Paul Postma, and these are numbered, right? Yeah, very nice. 986 out of 999. That's pretty cool. Numbered rookie card of the uh, the Winnipeg Jets. That's very nice. Let's put that aside. And then uh, Eric Johnson and Tyler Sagan. All right, very cool. We've got uh, two more packs to go. We've got Christmas Eve and then Christmas Day. So obviously I'm opening them up all in this video just to give you an idea of what you can get. But, uh, but yeah, if you do want to go the slower route, um, you can definitely do that. Ooh, that's really cool as well. This is 2021 OPG Platinum Retail. This is something I haven't opened yet at all. And uh, let's just see if we can get something cool. I believe there's four cards in every pack. And uh, ooh, that's a good name on the back. All right, let's take a look at this. Uh, we've got Nazem Kadri, And then a Cal Foot Marky Rookie Rainbow. That's very nice, actually. Wow. Uh, Rainbow Marky Rookies. Okay, and then Timothy Liljegren, Marky Rookie Retro. And look at that, Tim Stutzla, Marky Rookies. That's pretty nice. That's one of the better ones you can get in a OPG Platinum. So there you go, lots of rookie cards in that pack. That is awesome. And uh, let's finish it off in a big way with uh, the Christmas Day pack right here. Uh, let's see if we can pull a Kirill Kaprizov Young Guns. Uh, that would be pretty sick. And it seems like we do have an autograph here. And whoa, that's actually sick. Henrik Sedin. Look at that. Henrik Sedin. That's a sticker auto, but from Be a Player Signatures. 0607. Wow, that is so awesome. Oh my goodness. Uh, yeah, the Sedin twins, obviously, some of the greatest uh, Swedes to ever play in the NHL. That is just absolutely gorgeous. Uh, wow, I kind of like that more than getting a pack because you know my random pack luck is not amazing I know it's been actually a lot better as of late So I probably shouldn't be uh, be saying that but that probably beats anything we would have gotten in a pack That is so nice Wow, so I guess even if you don't hit the uh, Kirill Kaprizov you're probably getting something amazing anyways on uh, on Christmas Day Look at that 
That is so cool. Yeah, uh, Henrik Sedin, well, both Henrik and Daniel were uh, some of my favorite players to watch growing up. Uh, Vancouver was actually my second favorite team for a long time. And uh, yeah, that is that is just absolutely amazing. I don't know how much this is worth. I'll definitely have uh, put it down below if I found a comp on eBay. But uh, yeah, that is so cool. Probably have to get a Daniel autograph now. Uh, wow, there you go. That's the uh, Flip Packs Countdown to Christmas Edition. And wow, like for $40, again, that is absolute value. I got six packs and a Henrik Sedin autograph. Uh, Tim Stutz, Lamarkey rookies, Lilia Grin, like so many cool cards. Cal Foot. There's a hobby pack of Elite, which is just crazy. Out of $9.99 and yeah, just a bunch of very nice cards. So there you go. That is uh, honestly really impressive. It's a very nice cheap alternative compared to uh, you know the other subscription boxes that you can find that is actually really awesome and once again a plus for uh, the originality there that is just so cool i really like the uh, idea of opening up a pack every single day and you know if uh, i got that henrik Sedin on christmas day it probably would have been a pretty awesome gift so uh wow that was uh that was a blast thank you so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed i'll have a link down in the description if you do want to purchase any of uh, the flip packs and wow that was just a blast thank you so much for watching this video and as always i hope to see you all next time